Welcome back. Time now, 611. Childhood obesity is on the rise. Numbers from the CDC show in 2008, nearly 20% of kids ages 6 to 11 were obese. Washington and healthcare officials are working hard to combat childhood obesity, and more schools are getting involved too. This morning, I'm joined by Jody Ditcher, principal of Charles L. Warsler Elementary in Canton. The school is getting national recognition uh, for the work they've been doing. Good morning to you. Thanks for taking the time. Thank you for having me. Tell, now, your school is one of 179 schools across the country that are being recognized by the Alliance for a Healthy Generation. It's a group funded in part by the American Heart Association. Tell us a little bit about some of the changes you guys are making at the school or have made and, and, and have future plans to make. Well, first of all, it's part of Plain Local's mission. We have okay. a five-point star. And right. in, in order to educate the whole child, wellness is a part of that. Right. And so Alliance for a Healthier Generation is a framework uh, that's free. Uh, to any school that would like to be part of that and it helped us to sort of look at what we were doing and to kind of hone in some of our practices and we started with them about a year ago. What, what made you really sort of sort of latch on to this made you decide this is going to be something that you really want to put up as one of those points on that star? Well the, the wellness point was was there when I got there yeah um, along with content standards and characters and you know sure. arts and things like that but with wellness you, you also have to be able to measure and you can't just say that that's what you're part of. You have to be able to, to measure that and have a kind of a framework for making it happen. And the Alliance gave us that framework. And there's really a lot of flexibility of how you want to address it. Um, in, our, in our school, we, we looked at their criteria. Mm -hmm. And we, we just did small things. We started a walking club. Right. Um, every, about every week, they send us jam and minute, a, a lot of... Um, uh -huh. A lot of things over the uh, internet, uh -huh. um, and one of the things is called Jam and Minute, and we meet with our students every morning for morning welcome. And so um, there is a book called Be Well by the Michael and Susan Bell Foundation. Mm -hmm. Mothers have written ways that they have changed lifestyles. So we made that a homework that was done over the line. So when the students would respond, they would get to lead Jam and Minute for the whole school. And that was one of the things, rather than rewarding students with food, those types of things, they got to exercise in front of the school. So that was what. So what yeah, avoid the, the food reward, and instead you're going to exercise and yes. get to you know, mm -hmm. express yourself a little bit with that. Mm -hmm. It's such a great idea, and uh, and it's so cool that you guys are being recognized nationally for it. It's just a, it's so great. Congratulations to your principal, uh, Jody Bitcher from Charles L. Warsler Elementary School. Now, a friend from Stark County came all the way up here to see us. We really mm -hmm. appreciate it. Thanks for taking the Thank time you. this morning. Thank all right. You. Let's see what's going on out there traffic-wise at just about 614. Pat Butler has all the info on that.